People often wonder if super speed could in fact be possible in reality. Well, super speed could be possible. Uh, the human brain is normally key to a 24-hour cycle called the circadian rhythm. And this regulates bodily functions, including sleep, uh, metabolism, and aging. And this is centered around the supercosmetic nucleus, near the hypothalamus. And if this supercosmetic nucleus were to be large enough, you would be able to move uh, at a different, you'd be experiencing the world at a differentiated frame than other people. So if you have a super, if your supercosmetic nucleus is enlarged, you would move more or less 10 times faster than the average person. But it is not without its ill effects, however. Your metabolism uh, would increase. You would have an advanced metabolism, requiring up to 200,000 calories per day, which is 16 times that of an Olympic, super, uh, an Olympic swimmer's daily diet, uh, as well as a relatively high aging process. Uh, let's say you gain brain weight, you get brain weight in treatment therapy at the age of 18, which somehow uh, enlarges your supercosmetic nucleus, or SCN. You would be aging again at a relatively uh, fast pace from the age of 18 onward. So uh, at the age of 24, from the age of 18 having your SCN enlarged, you would look to be in your mid to late 40s, maybe early 50s. As well as um, due to the high advanced metabolism, you would be virtually eating yourself. Eating The body would be eating itself, uh, emitting ketones. You'd have an ammonia or, ammonia or uh, cheese uh, smell. So, to those of you who say, super speed is impossible, well, you're wrong. Super speed is possible. It's just the downsides aren't exactly the best.